Hey everybody, what's up? It's old Pappy back with another video. And today I'm gonna to be trying out the new skirmish mode. Um, it's kind of a crazy one. It has a bunch of uh, robots set up with one-shot kill trebuchets. Now, uh, of course you can one-shot people with a trebuchet in the normal game if they're uh, running a light bot or something like that. But these ones are insane. You're gonna see that they have a different color uh, laser energy blast uh, and they're, they're kind of reddish rather than the typical yellow and uh, whenever you see that on the test server it be, or um, or on the skirmish mode or whatever um, basically that means it's going to be insane um, you should be able to one shot guys basically with at least one if not two of these trebs and so I'm going to start off the game today uh, with the Raven. The Raven has a double jump and uh, you know there are all these robots you can see they're all equipped with these echo shields um, there you go, I just got that guy. Um, and I think whenever you see this kind of setup, when Pixonic gets this out here, um, what they really need, want you to do is just kind of have some fun. Just to, you know, don't take it too seriously. It's all just, uh, all just in fun. And so, uh, yeah, I just took out that other guy with that nice jump there. So what I'm going to try to do is take advantage of the Raven's jump ability here. Um, you saw that when I jumped over top of that barrier and took him down. Another thing I'm going to try to do is maybe try to jump sideways on, with robots that can jump and sort of shoot as I jump to the side. Um, you know, just trying to line up guys and maybe hit them as I'm flying across the uh, across the screen. Um, in part, I do that as an act of surprise. I just got another guy. Oh. Um, but I, I'm also doing that because it's a lot harder for them to hit me if I'm flying across uh, the screen. Um, than if I'm just standing still shoot holy macaroni look at that I just got a rampage and I'm only I'm not even two minutes into the game yet um, geez these guys might want to godlike wow these guys might want to start paying attention to me I guess um, but you know what if they're just gonna stand here and let me hit them no well, I'll hit them um, that guy took that at blast on his shield I'll see if I can get him when he comes around but I got to be careful because this guy on the left hand side's also aiming for me here and let me see if I can get this guy got him all right so that's a godlike and boom he got me so ah, not bad eh um barely two minutes in the game and i already have six kills and i'm in first place uh ugh, look at this guy uh, uh, running now uh, talk about going from the beauty to the beast here so i went from the raven which has beautiful double jump abilities to the uh, good old natasha um the steady eddie from yesterday here um and yeah so anyway uh, see you later natasha sorry about that um let's come back with the patent and see if it can do any better you know, it's kind of funny that Pixonic has picked these old school robots um, to be part of the skirmish along with these new fancy ones like Raven um, and Inquisitor uh, because, you know, a lot of the newer bots, they all have special abilities and then you have ones like Patton that I'm in now and uh, Natasha. Uh, wow, has he ever addressed me here? Holy cow. Um, but, you know, um, uh, these old school bots back in the day, I mean, I've been playing for four years and I, I had these in my hangar and I loved using them back in the old fashioned days. And sometimes I'd even put four, um, four aphids on my, on my patent um, and just go to town. But of course, when you're playing skirmish mode, pretty hard to compete when you're in a Natasha against a bunch of robots that can go into stealth mode or jump or dash towards you or whatever. Um, so anyway, let's come back at it here. And now I'm in my Inquisitor. Got the two Echo Shields looking like Batman. And I'm trying... Ah, oh, got another kill. Look at that. So I'm in second place. Got seven kills. Um, certainly not the same production that I had in that first minute and a half when I took out six guys, but... We'll see if we can get a few more kills before this video is over. So here's a technique. Jump over top of the guy, turn like a ninja, and line him up. Boom. All right, so because I only have the single Inquisitor here, I'm going to have to hit him probably another couple times. Um, oh, there you go. I got him. Okay, so let's see. I, there was a shot coming from over there. Where are the other guys lined up here? Okay, so that guy's on the other end of the map, and I have this guy on that side. He just tried to hit me, but he hit that rock. And, ah, see, he's behind that barrier that was over there where I, when I was fighting the Patton. And, uh, yeah, I'm hitting the barrier every time, eh? Okay, well, I'm going to try to work my way over, but I also got to be careful because where'd that guy go? Oh, he's still over there? You know, one of the unfortunate things with uh, 
skirmish I find sometimes is that uh, people quickly drop out of the game. So if you look now, there's only three of us left. Uh, I was kind of hoping that maybe the, the, a lot of other guys would stay in it so we could maybe get a really high kill count here for you. Um, but geez, if we know with only three of us here, it might be a little hard to, to really rack up the body count here. But I'm going to try. Uh, so it's eight kills for me. I'm back in first place. And that guy, man, he's still hugging that barrier over there. And I need to get him before my uh, my other enemy does. Um, because he's going to steal my kill. And actually, you know what the funny thing is? Is that this is one of those modes where stealing kills is awesome. You, I mean, I that's what you got to do. you got to find the guys that are out of low health. Yeah, I just wasted my shot on that rock. And uh, I still want to get over there and get him before my, uh, my other enemy does. You know he's just got him lined up. And I shoot. Oh, that dirty son of a gun. He stole my kill. Did you see that? He hit it just before I did. Let's see. There's still two of us left. I'll come around the corner here and see if I can find... Okay, that guy's behind me. Ah, oh, he's in a rave and he took me out. Look at that. See how he used his double jump there? He jumped in the air and I thought he was going to land and then he jumped again. See, that was uh, bad thinking on my part because for a second I thought, oh, he must be a griffin. But there is no griffin in the hangar. So now I'm coming back in the Strider. Oh, another kill, so that gives me nine. Strider has five dash. It's uh, pretty quick, goes 60 kilometers an hour. And um, although I don't really like using Strider in the regular game, it's actually not bad in a free-for-all because, uh, especially in a mode like this where guys are trying to line you up and the, uh, you know, and, and, and the aiming is so touchy with uh, these treb weapons, if, you know, you, you, you aim one little hair off target and you'll miss and so you can actually use the strider to zigzag toward your opponent or dash at the last second and try to avoid um uh, avoid getting hit so let's see here again you know this is a perfect situation when you have two guys that are lined up to take on each other except that guy took my kill that no good dirty dog but anyway uh, i'm going to come around the corner and see if i can get this guy um i still there's th still three of us left so the other guy is spawned in on the far right hand side of the map uh, this guy's down to a sliver. I need to get him before he does. And got him. All right. So let's see here. We got, um, geez, there's still two, uh, two guys uh, left in me. There's three guys. I'm up to 10 kills now. And let's see if I can lure this guy in. Don't want that guy in the right-hand side to hit me. But I want this guy to peek out and use my dash. And oh, no, I mistimed that a little bit. i try it again. See if I can get him lined up. Oh, hang on a second. He's in a strider too. And you know what? He's trying to do the exact same thing that I'm trying to do. Got him. All right. So, oh, and he, and he just spawned in. I can tell by that little red indicator that he did, did spawn back. So he's still in the game. He's probably getting tired of me killing him, I imagine. It's uh, 11 to 1, uh, or 11 kills, I should say, and I'm in first place. Um, these guys want me for sure. They're going to be gunning for me. Um, one of the things you, uh, in case you haven't played Skirmish that much, when you see that little crown up there, that tells you what position you're in. And look at that, I just got another rampage. Let's see here. If I can get this guy lined up, maybe I can get uh, 13 kills for this game. That wouldn't be that bad, considering there's only been three of us for the last three minutes. Let's see, I get him lined up, and... Ah, oh, missed him. Shoot. I gotta hug this thing, I gotta turn my shield toward him. I'm taking a risk here. And come on. Oh, he's in a skirmish too. Look, or a strider too. Look at this guy. Look at us. We look kind of ridiculous, eh? Look at us, like two little baby bats here, just like running around trying to hit each other. Um, kind of brings to mind one of those old Benny Hill, uh, those Benny Hill shows from the BBC, like um, that always ended off with a bunch of people just running around uh, with crazy, wacky uh, music playing in the background, and they're all chasing each other. Uh, but anyway, let's see if I can get this guy. It's really hard to kind of get him lined up because you got to keep your shield toward him and then turn and... Oh, man, look at that. We got each other at the same time. Ah, well, my hat's off to that guy. That was a great dance and a great duel. And uh, let's see, i got a minute and 27 seconds left. i got 13 kills. And I'm going to come back in with my Raven probably as my final bot. I'm going to see if I can take out one more guy. Ah, oh, that man, oh, man, that guy just keeps killing my uh my kills here we keep hitting it must be just like a split second in between shots here let's see here all right my friend let's see if i can lure you out what do i want to do i just want to there we go i'm trying to lure him make him shoot i'm not even sure what he's i think he may have seen another strider I, i'm not 100 percent sure 
kind of hard for me to take him down with my I got my turn my turn my side to him. He's got a single treb, not a double treb. I can tell because he he didn't even blow my shield off. And oh man, I got 10 seconds left before I can jump again. And there's only 35 seconds left in the game. I'm gonna have to take a, I'm gonna take a risk here. I'm gonna try to jump out, uh, lure him in, then jump to the right. Or oh, oh, let's see, I missed my time, my jump. That didn't work out very good. And oh, son of a gun, he got me. All right, well, 16 seconds left. I don't even know if I can get across the map in 16 seconds. I'm gonna take my shot though. I'm gonna, can I hit him? And come on, come on, come on. Oh. Jeez, just missed him. Okay, only four seconds left. Well, listen, I think that's it for this game. Um, yeah, there you go. Uh, you know, it's like I said, I played this game earlier today and I scored 2.1 uh, million. I was kind of shocked, but um, I don't think I'm going to get as high a score th this time around because there just wasn't a lot of other players. Uh, they all seem to just disappear on us here or we killed them one or the other. Yeah, there you go. I got 1.6 million. Not bad. Uh, 13 kills. Um, I'm kind of happy about the two rampages and especially the couple godlikes that I got. That was fun. Um, and before I let you go, I just want to show you a couple uh, really cool snipes from a different game that I played today, um, both using jump. And so the first one here, I'm in my Inquisitor, and this is just a technique you can use. There's a guy behind that barrier. I'm going to jump over and snipe him as I come down. Bang. And then I finish him off, and he's gone. And so for snipe number two, it's going to come up in a second here. I'm in my Raven. Remember, I have my double jump. I'm going to jump, and then I'm going to jump to the left in midair, and swing around, bang, and take him out. And uh, now I'm going to march up over here, and um, the, second, uh, the, the last snipe is going to come up in a few seconds here. Got to turn around, make sure that no one's coming after me. And uh, I'm gonna, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take this guy out here. Um, this isn't the snipe. I actually missed him here, and I got caught up in this. And pretty lucky he didn't turn around and kill me. I'm actually kind of shocked. Actually, I don't know what he's doing. He's just kind of running away. Um, but once I get this guy out of the way, come on out there, Holmes. There we go. And he's dead. And then I'm going to set you up for this. This was probably one of the best shots, single shots I've ever done in this game. And so this dude's over and he's hiding. I come over and check on the left-hand side to see what he is. Can't really tell. I have one chance to hit him. I got a little opening there. And if I time it just perfectly, boom, got him. Well, there you go. Uh, that's it. That's uh, my video for today. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Um, again, if you're going to play skirmish mode, uh, just go into it for fun. I did. It's a lot of fun. One shot kills, kind of uh, everybody's dream. And uh, if you like what you see, as always, please click subscribe and tell your friends. And until next time, uh, have a lot of fun out there and good luck on the battlefield.